Hey guys, we're back in another video on Marvel Future Fight. This is Psylocke Disassembled, or X-Men Disassembled. <laughs> no, we didn't disassemble Psylocke, if you're wondering. But anyways, um, you know, this character, I like. I don't know. I mean, the thing is, they actually really improved on the one of the attacks, and the attack is really, really funny because um, it's not the last attack, but the second last attack, and they had have all the scene and stuff going, which is really, really cool. Butterfly Fiasm. This one allows you to increase dodge rate, increase mind damage, and whatnot. So this is the Psydic Blade, right? And this one is the one that's really cool. Uh, you have the third attack. This one has immune to all damage, so I do do like her. But thing is, actually, to be honest, I mean, even though she has immune to all damage, she gets hurt easily. And in my opinion, that's not that great. I don't know why, but hey, uh, you know, at least she has immune to all damage. And then you have this one, which has mind damage. So, you know, she needed a bit more boost and hopefully this actually does it but let me go back to the original Psylocke yeah I mean the original Psylocke had it too I don't know I mean she wasn't that powerful in my opinion when I was using her but going into uniform 30% to penetrate with penetrate mine immunity so you know your character that has immune to mine damage well now we have 30% to penetrate that Third attack and fourth attack is really the new one, and I think the fourth attack is actually the newest one. And looking at it here, as you can see, really, really cool attack. It has this cool moon thing right there. I mean, it's like a whole animation. And this one, you know, the focus, there's something new here, but nothing too, like, drastic. In my opinion, it's just a new attack. It has a shield there. And that shield is the immune to all damage. And, of course, uh, that's a 10-second frequency cooldown time thing. So, you know, you got 5 seconds for immune to all damage. And it can reflect mind damage. So, only mind damage. Nothing else increases attack and whatnot. Let's see what else do we have. It costs 1,050. This should really cost 750 in my opinion. But now they're charging you 1,050. Now if you like a female character. I think she is pretty hot in my opinion. Look at that saber right there. Obviously looks very similar to Psylocke here. Uh, except she's more elegant in this suit. This one is sexy. That one is is elegant all right so anyways let's go on in there and we're gonna do a little preview of the character let's see how she is now let's start off with the first attack i mean second bam third this is the new one there you go there's that shield that's just counting down and once it's gone at least you know you're not protected anymore all right, four. All right, so that was really, really cool. All right, so that was the last attack. Unfortunately, that's pretty much it. I mean, I wish there was more, uh, but I do like this attack. I think I like it the most. This is the fourth attack. You know, as far as I know, I haven't had that much strength to use her. Not the uniform, not the new uniform, but just generically. But I'm not going to get it yet. We'll see what happens. I only have 900 crystals and I don't plan to buy any more. But anyways, let me know what you think about Psylocke in the comments below. We will be back in the next video. Be sure to like the video. Subscribe to this channel for more Marvel stuff. And... Always comment in the comment section below if you see something new, something different, something I should have talked about. But anyway, she looks really, really cool.